Acting QFES Commissioner Mike Wassing is speaking on the death of firefighter Isabella Nash. Of proud parents, Philip and Maggie, partner to Beck, sister to Elizabeth, and auntie to Corey and Taylor. She's a friend to many. I've met with Izzy's family and passed on my personal and the organisation's sincere condolences. Our hearts break for them and will continue to be there with them and for them in the days and weeks and months ahead. Izzy's partner, Beck, is also one of our firefighters and we extend our sympathy and our love to Beck. The fire service is a very tight community. We stand side by side at incidents, supporting each other to protect communities and to save lives. We proudly wear the uniform and work closely with all those around us under challenging circumstances. They are family. And as we come to the terms of this devastating loss of one of our own, we are there for them and we are th there for each other. What unfolded yesterday also resulted in the very serious injury of firefighter Leah Drew. Leah remains in hospital and she has been moved from the critical care unit to the burns unit. As she commences her road to recovery, we are all support, also supporting her and her family. I would like to particularly acknowledge the exceptional work of our people who were on the scene yesterday. During the most difficult of times, outstanding actions and commitment were remarkable. We, and I personally sincerely thank you for your efforts yesterday. I would also like to thank the enormous support from communities right across Queensland and Australia, also fellow firefighters, and I've personally received many messages from chief officers and commissioners right across Australia and globally. We thank you for your support. Our firefighters attend thousands of incidents every year. And whilst we have excellent systems in place to make the response as safe as possible and safety is of our people and the community is always forefront of mind, there are inherent risks and sometimes unpredictable dangers associated with this line of work. There are police and work uh, health and safety investigations currently underway that will thoroughly examine the incident and piece together what unfolded yesterday. For that reason, we cannot provide any further incident information, but I can assure you that what, what that we want the answers to. I can assure you that we want the answers to for Izzy, for Leah, for their families and for their colleagues. But right now our focus is on supporting them. So tribute there for Isabella Nash, Izzy, as she's known, this senior firefighter who did die in this fire at Slacks Creek in Brisbane, an industrial area. You heard there investigations are going on. This has been declared a crime scene, so obviously suspicions around the blaze itself. And also there has been talk of whether or not breathing apparatus may have failed for Isabella and also the other firefighter you heard there who's also been taken hospital, still suffering serious injuries. But... Clearly a uh, very upset QFES acting commissioner there on the death of that firefighter, Isabella Nash, there in Queensland.